show y'all at church, but it's Wednesday and it looks like there's service or something, even though it's two o'clock in the afternoon. Well, I guess that makes sense because people are out of school, kids are out of school. Anyway, look at this gorgeous house. I feel really weird filming other people's houses. I'm afraid someone's going to yell at me in French or German. Um, which would be even more terrifying, especially because I don't understand any German. Well, this house. But the main reason we came up here, other than the fact that I can't show you the church, is to show you this school, which I'm pretty sure is closed right now. All the windows are drawn and all that. Um, but yeah, so I found this completely by accident the other day, along with that building right there that we're going to go check out. The bells are still ringing. They're still ringing. I don't know how long it's been. I think they started ringing at 2.15? No. Because when I looked at my phone, it said 2.14, so maybe like 2.10, and it's now 2.20. I, I don't know. I don't know how long they're supposed to ring. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm still feeling like out the zoom on this camera. Oh, I forgot about the bees. I walked by this bush the other day, and it just buzzed at me the whole time, so we're going to stay over here. roads I can't tell if they're private or if they have an outlet or not but anyway this I believe is also a school but I haven't found a sign anyway this is the library I think it's open right now but I'm not really sure I'm gonna go check Okay, there's voices in there. I don't know who's in there right now because I'm pretty sure the school is closed. We're gonna go this way. I went nosing around over here the other day. Um, I'm not sure if this is actually a house. I think it's a pub or something. Why am I speaking so quietly? Yeah, but that's really nice. The lack of like privacy fences here is kind of, it's definitely a culture shock. But then again, if you have such beautiful gardens in all of your backyards, why wouldn't you want to show them off? <laughs> See, just that, like, it's just a driveway, but it's beautiful. <laughs> okay. So I don't actually know where either of these, I say either, there's like three. That one's a walking path. I don't know where this is. We're gonna go up here. someone's field, I guess. We'll go back. And now, we're going to go this way. Although I'm pretty sure it's just walking. Or, I don't know, like 10 minutes? I looked on, actually I'm going to wait for the plane to pass and then I'm going to tell you. camera to see over this 
wall because it's just tall enough but I don't really see over it right at eye level really convenient anyway so I found this path the other day and I was curious where it went so I looked on the map and it doesn't look like there's actually anything back here it's just that if you follow it long enough you end up at the casino and I didn't show you the casino because it's kind of on the outskirts of town. But it's a pretty nice place. Uh, Erwin, that's my host dad. I'm saying his name with the wrong accent, but that's his name. Let me see. Yeah, no, trees are too thick. What about now? Nah. Anyway. The first couple of days I was here. Oh! Was that a wasp? Right, okay. This might be a bad idea. <laughs> That's a little bit better, maybe. You zoom in. Anyway, so my host dad the other day was just showing me around the town driving. I said the other day. This was like the first week I was here. Actually, the first couple of days I was here. So, yeah. Man, this vlog is not going to be very interesting if the second half of it is just this walking path. I'm going to give it a couple more minutes. Oh, wait. We've got some chain link fence right here. It's getting interesting. Is this back up to the Catholic school? No, but dang. <laughs> That's nice. All right, so this wasn't a totally wasted walk. That's cool. I honestly did not know this was back here. And I'm still praying I'm not about to get attacked by some bug, so. We're going to tread carefully. Man, these trees, they are so tall. I haven't been around trees this tall since I left Evansville. Good grief. Okay. Yep. Yeah. I don't know if the camera quality is good enough to make this out, but this is like, and there goes a the church again. I don't think it's the same church. This view is crazy. All right, okay. That might be as far as we need to go down this way. So, yeah, let's go back. Yes, they are going. Sorry, there was a child. Anyway, here is La Maison de Lille that I posted on my Instagram the other day. I'm not really sure why there's this right next to the library. I guess if the library is closed and you just really need a book. But there are books in here that weren't in there the other day, so that means that people are definitely returning them. Anyway going this way. Dog poop trash can. Nice. And yeah. So basically I walked by over there yesterday and this guy came down the road and I was like, what is up here? And you couldn't see all of this so I came up here and I was just like oh my gosh what is this gorgeous place so we're gonna go back over here to this little water feature I'm not sure if this used to be a functioning I don't know well or something at one time there's no signs. 
there's no signs that say anything about it, so I really have no idea. But, yeah, and there's the library, and someone's house, and that's basically it. Let's go back. Alright, I am headed back home now. Uh, I went over behind the church because the door was open and I thought, mm, maybe they're done. Uh, European church services don't normally last that long, so I figured, eh, I might as well try. I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to drive that way, sir. That was weird. Anyway, um, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, so I went behind it, but they still seem to be in service. I heard singing. I think there might have been a funeral going on. I wasn't really sure. A lot of people were wearing dark clothes, but it's hard to tell. And, but there were a bunch of flowers in front of the door, so I'm not really sure what that was about. Anyway, um, I went around the back of the church, and I swear, I, it was probably just a shadow. It's hard to tell because it's cloudy, but it was probably just a shadow from a house. It seemed like everything suddenly got darker. I heard a crow calling overhead, and then I kid you not, I look up and there is this black cat right in front of my face. I was like, what is this sudden gothic experience that I'm having? And then I walked away and everything went back to normal, but it was really weird. So anyway, I'm going home now. Um... I need to go get my purse, and then I'm gonna walk to Leclerc, which is the grocery store, uh, because I need bananas. My host dad bought bananas, because that's what I asked for, um, but everyone in this house eats bananas, and there's six of us, and they're all gone. So, I'm gonna go buy some bananas. Oh, I haven't mentioned yet, yesterday when I said that they were out for the day, that was true, but it was also kind of a lie. They're actually out for the whole week. And I just didn't want to advertise the fact that I'm going to be by myself in the house for a week. And this isn't going up until after they come back, so it's fine. Alright, so I'm back. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go to Leclerc. I don't know what I'm going to do the rest of the week. The girl that I was supposed to go hiking with on Saturday just told me that she can't anymore, but... I met another girl on the Facebook group, another American au pair, who is actually living in France in a place that's not too far from here, so maybe she'll want to do something later this week, I don't know. Um, but regardless, I think I'm probably going to try to catch the bus to Saint Louis and take the train to Mulhouse on Friday, so that will probably be the next vlog, unless my plans fall through again. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this. Uh, yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye.